Welcome to Silent Circle Video Tutorial. In this segment, we are going to cover the basics of the Silent Phone app on an Android device. Firstly, to have the app installed, start at the Google Play Store and search Silent Phone and begin the install. Before you can log in and use the app, you must have a properly provisioned Silent Circle account. Proceed to SilentCircle.com and at the login page, click on the red Create Account link. At this point, you will set a username. Ensure it features all lowercase letters as well as numbers, and do not include uppercase letters, spaces, or special characters. Set a secure password and enter an email in order to receive billing information. After you accept the terms and conditions and continue, you can make purchases on your account at which point you can log into your app. Log in using the username and password you have just created. Now that we've logged in, we will cover some of the basic configurations that you can perform on the app. You can enable permissions to allow Silent Phone to use your device microphone as well as importing your contacts from your native contact list. In the top left pane of the app, you can select the blank avatar and then select an image from your phone's photo gallery. The image you select will immediately be reflected in the top left pane and will be visible to other Silent Phone users. By selecting the avatar at any time, you can change it using your gallery or camera, or delete it to have it remain blank. Now we're going to cover starting a message conversation using Silent Phone. The red plus button brings you to a search bar that allows you to search within the Silent Phone directory as well as your phone's contacts. Search results will pop up as you type, and tapping on a result will open a conversation window. At this point, you can send messages with various forms of media, which will be covered in a later video. A conversation thread will be visible to you from this point, and after you have sent a message, your contact will have the thread populate as well in their conversation history. In regards to calling via silent phone, in the new conversation window, you can search via username or contact name, and if you have Silent World, you can dial a number using the keypad button on the top right corner. With a conversation window open, a phone call can be initiated by hitting the phone icon in the upper pane. When a call is connected between two silent phone users, the touch and verify function provides a pair of short authentication strings that are used to secure the call. Thank you for watching this tutorial for Silent Phone Android. We invite you to view more of our content, or if you have questions, please contact our customer support.